Well, just a really quick update. I don't have uh, a whole lot changed on the sim lately, but uh, I was able to do some levers for my SciTech unit. Um, these I, uh, I patterned off of the the original drawings that are available in the a link in the resource section of Hangar 45. I don't have the reversers on yet, but uh, these just slide right on to my, uh, my SciTech units. Actually, I can't pull it off with one hand right now, but they're they're pretty good fit. And uh, will give me something a little bit better looking for the meantime once I smooth them out and give them a paint job. So uh, I think what I'll do is get some reverser levers printed and set on there and uh, then do a, a flap cover here, or spoiler I should say, and then uh, I'm not sure what I'm going to do with the flap just yet, but uh, in the interim, it'll do until I uh, until I can get around to maybe getting one of the uh, one of the uh, available throttle quadrants that are made by uh, made on the hangar uh, marks. So uh, yeah, that's pretty much it for now. Not a whole lot changed. Don't have the sim booted up. Uh, pretty eager to uh, get those painted and take a flight. And uh, these AML caps in my previous videos, these are the incorrect ones. You can see that they're recessed down in a little too far compared to these ones, which are raised a bit. I was able to print off enough replacements for all of these. I just have to paint them. And then I can get rid of these incorrect ones and get the lens covers on. And then I have to interface this panel. Let me make myself a little landing gear knob and a few other things. Um, I forget what... Uh, I think it's a ground proximity warning fail uh, light that goes in there. These are butted up against my monitor, so I can't put an AML switch in there. But now that I have the pattern for these caps, I can simply print one that has a little bit of a backer, and I can put the LED in there. And that'll be that. So, all in all, things are coming along. And, uh, yeah, pretty much uh, that's about it. Other than uh, that's what the old SciTech knobs used to look like. But uh, this looks a little more like the part. Definitely uh, a little bit more like the real ear. So pretty happy with that. Thanks for watching.